Hey folks, Tivik here, and whoa, that tree just grew. Welcome back to Minecraft Season 4. We are in Episode 12, and um, I have fixed this one up. So, everything that is dumped out here now should hopefully be, at some point, some wood. And perhaps some saplings. Hmm, not sure. Uh, maybe not, um, but it should definitely be oak wood. The saplings, it should not pick up if it has enough, yeah. So that means that there will be saplings going in here and eventually going into this chest. Yeah, look at that, 60 saplings. Um, I wonder if I can... Hmm, worth a try. If I get some of these sticks. Now, let's catch this one and talk to him. I don't want saplings there. Can I put a stick in or something? No. Okay, so it has to keep that. Okay, that's fine with me, but I would rather not have had so many of it. Anyhow, so what this one is doing, it's going around, it's dumping everything in this here, which is then extracted using nothing else than one of these item hoppers, which is a new thing. The item hoppers drop it down, well actually this pumps it out of there and it gets sent to this here machine, which... Ah, oh, come on. Okay, that's good enough. Didn't I have three? I get this one too. There we go. Um, it's sent out into this one, which then zips along, and uh, I can't see any of them. Okay, well, it goes into this one, and uh, this one smelts, and since it outputs to all sides, it goes down and also to this side, it will try to put it there. I'm thinking about doing a change here, so it doesn't really... We'll put some more in here. I'm not sure if there's some kind of load balancing way. But I am getting plenty of charcoal to fuel my machines in here for now. Also, I've put most of my things over in these. So, look at this. A lot of things. Which means I've removed these chests. I also put them in this buffer to make sure that energy can go somewhere. And these are actually out. And this is something that I want to do. Uh, I want to set something up with so that these are refilled. And I can do that with Applied Energistics. And here's another thing I've done. You see this one? And uh, I hope it's bright enough down here. I'm going to light it up just some more to be 100%. What happens here is that that thing there... Oh, there is one of these, um, oh, what are they called? Let me see, I'll check what we can use the cape for. Um, uh, import buses and export buses, yes, that's the one. This is an import bus. It will suck items out of this one at a rate of, I think it's one per second, which means that whenever I were to smelt some things, if I get some... Let's get ore. We'll get some iron and some silver. There we go. And I just dump this in here. This one gets uh, cut into pieces and then sent into here. So it's smelted, it goes in there, and the system pulls it out. And if we look at silver, we have 238. And then, 39. Brilliant, isn't it? Oh yeah. So I can then plug this system in, but of course it has started to use a little bit of extra energy units, but I'm good with energy for now. It's not really going that low. So, that's what I've been doing. Also, more steel, but I'm running low on iron. And we are full of creosote. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. This is the stats for this one. 
Um, 63 types, 38 types. So we do need to put in more of these, but I don't have so many of these quartz yet. What I want to do now though, um, I'm gonna check the iron. I do have 200 something iron and uh, steel I have 60, well 96. Um, we do need to start worrying about setting up some boilers and I do want to make some kind of farm so that I can get a lot of wheat and I'm thinking I'll go with Steve's cards this time too so we need an engine but the main thing is a farmer it's unbreakable but this one is probably the one I'll do we'll need to make some PCBs it's uh, just iron gold and redstone so iron Let's get half a stack. Gold, and this is one of the bad things with this. Um, you can't really get a little bit of it. You need to get like half a stack or some. And redstone. There we go. Oh. And I will craft two PCBs. Right, and then we need gold, iron, and three diamonds. Do I have diamonds? Yeah, but not a lot after that. And that. And we have a basic farmer. Now we also need to have a hull, which is a bit of steel. So the iron wheels are just iron with sticks. Should be able to get. I'm not going to go for reinforced metal yet, so. Um, like that. And we have two wheels and this one and we have a standard hull now let's put this in and this one very nice I need to get some more of these panes that was the recipe for chest pain just wood and planks yeah we can do that so this farm out here is actually not giving me any wood. This is a pure... Well, looky there. Oh yeah, if this one is full... Can I get half-half, I wonder? Maybe. How's this one looking? Okay. Um, yeah, so... Let's see... Oh, I'm silly. That's not how it works. I need, of course, to put saplings in there. And apples, too. Or they won't be accepted. Right, what's I doing? Farmer, we need to have some chests. I'm gonna go with some side chests again and a top chest. I do think we have chest locks but a bunch of these pain thingies. Still have two of these. So for the side one we need four huge ones and two large. That's uh, 36 of these pain thingies. Shouldn't be too tricky to make, I think. That's 32 from these, so I'll just make another set. If I had enough, I would be able to. But, there we go. So, 64 of those. I'll make 1, 2, 3, 4, and then go there to 1, 2 these in the corners with these there and these there and we have side chests now the top chest was six of these large ones we need more a lot more
I don't think four will do. Probably. Yeah, it will do. I said six, right? And how many large ones? Top chest was... None. So, just these and then... Oh, I made too many. Doesn't really matter. Okay, so that and that. What attachments are there? Torch placer, railer, track remover. Hydrator is probably a good plan. And a fertilizer probably too. Hmm. Seat? There's a lot of cool things here. Milker lawn lawnmower. No. I'll go with a hydrator, so we need iron bars and a glass bottle. I think that's iron bars, yes. And glass. Do we have glass? We actually have a glass bottle. Awesome. Hydrator. And a tank. Is this for that or? Mm. Hmm. Tank panes are glass and glass panes. Okay. These are fairly complex, these machines, I say. So let's make a few of these. Thirty-two, and it's tank valve, which is iron around one of these, and then these glass ones around. Let's see. Can I make another one? Maybe. It's taking... Wow, that's a lot of time to assemble this one. And we also need an engine. Wow. And we can get rid of this. Uh, engine. Now, I'd like to make a solar engine, but I'm not sure... Uh, iron, redstone and glowstone makes a solar panel. How much more do I have in this one, actually? Oh, we have plenty. Right. Basic and compact swords. Advanced PCBs. We'll go with the simple ones. So a piston, three iron, and simple PCB. So yet again, we need gold. And iron. Do I have glowstone? Yes, I went gathering some of that. And redstone as well. So for that we need... I need two of those. Two solar panels. A PCB which was like... This, 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 this. And then redstone around. Awesome. And a piston. Mm. We actually need to do that. Um, I have all I need for a piston here. Awesome. I love Steve's carts. The recipes are so complex, but it's also kind of fun building them. Like this and this. Awesome. I do hope that it works on this one. Basic solar engine and top chest will clash. I wonder, is there another type of chest? Side and top. Hmm. Internal storage. We can do that. Let's do that. 
pain. And lock. one internal chest and we can get rid of this now and this and this and this and this brilliant now this takes 40 minutes to build and uh, we need to put in lots of more coal tell it to assemble 40 minutes so <laughs> I'm gonna be doing something else I think um, like for instance mining I need to do that anyhow so I'll catch you guys uh, in a bit so I took a trip to the Twilight Forest and uh, found this here thing. And I figured I'll go down here and check. I mean, what could happen? Whoa. These guys look a bit angry. Okay, so this is a dangerous area. Wow, this can take a beating. Um... Let's get the iron. No. Okay. What is that? Oh dear. What is that thing? Shoots slimes at me. Oh dear lord. This is dangerous. Did I not bring food? Okay. I can't cut through this. Oh, this is going to be painful. Come here. Okay, he's dead. Okay, I really need to do this when I have food. <laughs> this is a bit of a dangerous place to be. So I did happen to accidentally cut down a twilight oak. I was testing the mattock and well, it went poof. So let's see, where am I? There. So I was exploring this area to hopefully find some new cool stuff. But... Mostly, I needed to go mine, because I need iron, for instance, and a lot of other things. There we go. This is the top of one of these. Yeah. Hmm. I should probably head... Oh. Hey, I can walk through this log. Cool. Uh, it's roughly in this direction direction to get back home. But now I know where that thing is. Uh, yeah, so... Twilight Forest is causing some laggy issues, but the game isn't that bad. Look at this. And birds and... Well, that's alright. It's just these dark forests. It's a bit sad that I started in one because, as far as I understand, this is the last tier. So this is where all the all the big nasties are. And somewhere in here, oh, that's a huge spider. Let's see if I can dash away. I know it's dark in here, but. I'm supposed to find my trail of torches somewhere. I hope. Oh, that was close. I should not fall into any holes when I'm running like this. That would be unfortunate. Yeah, so I should find my trail of torches very soon. Here it is. And I can head back home. And we'll take a look at the... at the Steve's cart cart that is being made. See if it's anywhere near done. Maybe I should mine in this... Oh, look at this. Hello. 
what do we have here? Plenty of ores. This is tin, I think. Or silver, maybe. Let's look. I found some sort of squash. That was tin. And this looks like silver. What I really would like to find, though, is copper. Because I don't have so much of it. Oh, iron. Can't leave iron. Oh, these are Thorncraft to uh, toys. Well, stones. There we go. Oh. That wasn't the best of jumps ever. I kind of like this area. It's It's cool. Um However, this is not really the best place, as I said. Oh, lag. <laughs> there we go. My house should be over here. Somewhere. No. No house. What? There's no house? Where's my house and my portal? Now I'm nervous. Whoa, I shouldn't have done that. Creepers? Hmm. There it is. Whew. Alright. Portal. Where are you? Back. Home. Here's the thing. My room here, or my area, is not chunk loaded. Which means that nothing has happened. I think. Let's check the time on this one. Yeah, it's still at 30 minutes. That's about when I left it here. So I suppose I'll just have to get all this out. The coal can go in there. The dust as well. It will start pulling out now fairly quickly. Can do the iron ore, ferrous ore, lead, tin, silver, and that'll get smelted up and go in here. And this and this and this can go in there as well. And slime ball, the raw meat. What I use the meat for? Meat steak. Let's cook that up. I have a meat steak. That's interesting. Um, can I take food? No. I, uh, <laughs> that thought hit me. Maybe I could do that, but no. Um, are we really that low on food? Yeah, we are. Um, now the question is, I did replant here, so we have barley. means that we'll have a lot of barley because it grows fairly quick. There we go. And uh, we can just replant. Um, I will make a farm for wheat so we have plenty of food but also a source of biofuel so we can start doing that. Now the barley I know can be made into barley flour, which basically means I have 35 bread in my hand. Actually, can I macerate this? No, no. Just thought I could for a moment. Right, so we'll make 35 of that and put it in for smelting. We put in that one. It will get ejected into this one. So we can start picking up bread from here. Seven. Perfect. Starting to get some food there. 
Um, oh, and aluminum, but we can just dump that in there with everything else. Right, so I'm going to continue waiting now for this one to finish up. And I didn't collect the... No, I didn't collect all the stuff. Something I do want to do, and I've said this several times now, is start a bit with Ars Magica. I have a lot of levels, so actually let's do that right away. I'm just going to get all this. So what we need to start out with Ars Magica... Let me just take a look at what I need. First of all, we will need wool. Do I happen to have some wool? Yes. We will also need, uh, sure, of course, iron. But I just need a few. And then some planks. Uh, maybe there is some wood. Woof. Wood. So three of that, uh, and actually one more thing, but that is made using cobblestone. Um, yeah, the Vestish rune, this one. This is the one, so we need to make three of those. We'll start with that. These three, with that and that, and that makes the arcane empowerment table. Fancy. I'll just put it next to this one here. And I am now. I'm using up levels, as you can see. I have 195 mana. I am level 10. Awesome. Now I need to do a little bit of spells. Well, hmm. I need to make an inscription table. And for that I need spell parchment. We're going to need a bit of paper here. And, yep, spell parchments. And that needed at an inscription table. One apart from this table there, it needs a torch and a feather. And we have an inscription table. Can we break this one without going poof? Yep. This looks like a I break this at all. This mattock is made of iron, I think. So let's get iron. And repair it. There we go. And there we go. Now let's try this again. Well, it would be nice if it looked, if it was set the other direction. So we'll put it there then. Place down like a bed. Perfect. And now this table next to it. What do we need here? I have no known spells. Well, I do know Firebolt, Dig, Sense Energy. So these different kinds of runes are made using these rune Vestis ones. It's just colors. So. I'm thinking ah, an automated crafting table would be nice now. Um, I'll just start by making this spell here. Um, so we need to have lapis, I think. We're also going to craft up a whole bunch of these. Because we're going to need them. Um, I think it's Rune Lanu for this one. And a parchment. Got a fireball. Oh.
Um, that was probably not wise of me. I'm sorry. <laughs> I do have a firebolt at least. That's nice. Right. Can I do anything else with this? Can I improvise or... Um, yeah. So, this one was fire. Let's see, what flowers do we have here? Some yellow, do we have an E red? Well, just one rose red. And that's Kula, and we have Crocus. What happens if I put Crocus and Kula and Lanu? And I do need to have one of these parchments again. No. So, if I just get one more... That's an orange. I need red flowers. Can I find someone out? Oh yeah, over here. A lot of them. Perfect. And I'll just, whoa, not fall into that. That would be unfortunate. This and that makes orange. Make two of those, and I think it was a red one. The sense energy one. Two red ones. Hmm. I see. A red one. An orange and orange. A green one. How do you make the green ones? There we go. Still the sense energy ones, and I don't really know any spells, so we need a green one. It's probably a cactus green. Cactus green, and I don't have any cacti. Hmm. That's going to be an issue. Hmm. I wonder. I wonder, I wonder. There might be some... I can't find any scrolls or spell... Recipe... No. Alright. I think that maybe I am running way over time on this episode. Just give me a second here. I was definitely running over. Between this episode and the next one, I'll set up this new cart that we are making. And, um, yeah, see where we go from there. I also saw that these machines stopped. Mm. They're already out of... <sighs> Charcoal. Not sure that these are the most effective ones, unfortunately comparison to the hobbyist steam engine I had there before, but we'll have plenty. And I can get these four and just burn them for charcoal by putting them in these machines. Could put three in there. Oh, we had run out. That explains there we go. So, yeah, in the next episode, I'll keep working on making some spells, and we'll see if we can not burn things down. So I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.